Let's gain some experience with day-to-day -day basic file operations on a CentOS 8 stream system. This would be the same on any Linux system. So first let's create a couple of files. Uh, they could be empty or they could be small. Uh, one way to do it is to use the echo command and just say echo and direct actually nothing into file 1. Another way to do it is with the touch command. I'll just say touch file 2. Then if I do ls-a file 1 and file 2, I see two very small files that are both created uh, at the same time, basically. Uh, if I want to rename one of them, I could rename it with the move command, like move file 1 to file 1 new name. And then if I do ls-l star file star I see there it is uh, it, 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 it has the new name now if I want to remove them I can simply say rm file 2 and it just worked it's a good idea though to always use the I option for interactive when doing removal then I would say rm i dash i file 1 new name and it'll ask me if I really want to do it uh, many distributions will set up the I option to be the default so that you always have a chance uh, to change your mind about removing something before you do it. Now, how would I make a directory? I could do make dear, uh, dear one. And in fact, I can make more than one directory on the same line. I can do make dear, dear two, and dear three. And if I look now, I see I have three different directories. They're all actually empty. So let me put a couple of files in one of the directories. So I'll do touch dear2 file1 and I'll do touch dear2 file2. So if I do ls-lr just to see everything that's there in the directory files, uh, so I'll see dear1 is empty, dear2 has these two files, and dear3 uh, is also empty. Now the command for removing directories is rmdir. So let's say I just try to remove them all with a rmdir dir star. Uh, you notice it got rid of dir1 and dir2, but it couldn't remove dir1 dir and dir3, I should say. It couldn't get rid of dir2 because there's files in it. To do that, instead of using rmdir, I would say rmrf dear2 and then that goes and descends into the directory and gets rid of all the files. Be very careful with the rm-rf uh, command because if you give the bad argument you could even wipe out your whole system but that is the standard way to get rid of a whole directory tree. So that's just some of the very basic commands for renaming files, moving them, creating directories, removing them, etc.